Here I am with a midweek DCEU update. All right, so I've got two basic things I'm going to talk about today. First, I'm going to talk about the uh, uh, the Batgirl movie that just finished filming, and then I'm going to talk about the big report that just came out. I woke up to it this morning, and I didn't know if it was true, but I did find out today. I wanted to find out if it was true before I did a video on this, but it is very true, and it is very good for Snyder fans. So, Let's talk about the small potatoes first. So Batgirl did finish filming, and there was a post by both Leslie Grace and the girl who's playing um, Black Canary. Uh, they both posted that the four months of filming is finally over, so that movie is in the can, and I don't think it'll be making it out this year. Uh, it was originally slated for later this year. But because The Flash is being delayed, it wouldn't make sense to have Michael Keaton back as Batman in that movie if the events of The Flash have not occurred yet. So that movie is definitely going to be pushed back, which will help them, you know, polish it off and get it uh, where it needs to be. So let's talk about the report that I, I, I woke up to this morning. And this is pretty freaking crazy. I thought it was a rumor. I didn't think this was true until I saw the reports later today or earlier today. So I woke up and there was a thing saying that the Flash movie has was test screened yesterday and there were lots of good things that came from it. Uh, it was here's what it said. And I'm going to have this up on the screen so you can read this. Uh, but I want to read this word for word what it says. So let me get this up here. So ah, I had it ready to go and then it went to the background. So I said, The Flash had a screening last night, and here's what we know. The response was highly positive. Ben Affleck does continue as the DCEU Batman, and Zack Snyder's Justice League is canon for the main timeline. Now, we're going to talk about this. Main timeline is a big key there, okay? And the symbol of hope is back. Well, the single symbol of hope is Superman, so I, I envision Superman is going to be in it. And... I've been to some of these test screenings in the past. Uh, I think one big one that I saw was World War Z. I saw that movie long before it came out, like six months, kind of like what they did with The Flash here. And they didn't have finished special effects in there. So they might have, uh, Superman might be in it, but it probably was not uh, the final scene. Now, it what's crazy about this, so Zack Snyder's Justice League is canon. All right. There's no question about it. They are not erasing the, the Zack Snyder's Justice League. But what is happening is, and this has been confirmed by the Flash movie, is that Flash is going to be on an alternate timeline, not the main DCEU. So there are going to be some things that are going to be the same, but he is he will have messed everything up. And even though Zack Snyder's version is is out there, it's going to be pushed to the side in case they want to go back in the future and fix it. And I have a feeling that that's probably what The Flash 2 would be about, is him fixing all of this stuff. But it's great to hear that Ben Affleck will continue to be um, the DCEU Batman. And he may be recast for the role. Who knows? But at least his version of Batman is still going to be canon and in the universe, which is great. So he does not die. Uh, I don't know if he's going to go off with that branch that is going to be... Um, what do you call it? The branch that is going to be the, the, the main DCEU and then the Flash is on an alternate uh, timeline. So we're going to see where that ends up because, uh, you know, I was watching and it was really funny. Uh, I hate to mention her, but I have to in this case. Grace Randolph, because other people were posting. I don't follow Grace Randolph, but other people that I do follow and what I do see on Twitter, they do post her stuff. And she was trying to take credit. She goes, I told everybody that this was going to happen. She goes, there's a lot of scoopers out there today talking about this. But I was the first to report it a few weeks ago. And she she went on to say, you know, that things could change. And, you know, she she does her basic walk back on everything that she's ever said. I, I just, I don't care for her type of reporting. Uh, if I'm going to report to you guys, I've said this many times in the past, it is going to be either truth and if it's rumor, I'm going to come out and say it is rumor. I thought that I was going to be coming in today talking about this being rumor. But in fact, they did. It has been confirmed that they do, did do a test screening and that these things are happening. So this has definitely got me excited to go see the movie. Uh, I know that all hope is not lost. And with the merger happening very, very soon here in the next week or so, uh, we're going to see some big changes. And I think we're going to see them rather quickly. I don't think we're going to have to wait until 
the DC Fandome this year to be able to hear about what some of these changes are. So it's an exciting time to be a DC fan. Uh, it, it's There's a lot going to be happening, and I will be covering all of it in the coming weeks and months. So I appreciate all the support. If you guys haven't already, please hit the like button on the video. It helps the algorithm tremendously. The more I can get my message out there, the easier it's going to be, and the more money I can put into doing some of the things that I do. And if you also hit that notification bell so you will be notified as I have new videos go up. I have lots of things on my channel other than just DC stuff. I review movies, TV shows, and a few other things. Uh, so lots of things moving on my channel right now. And uh, if you guys can help me out by liking and subscribing and hitting that notification bell, it will help my message get out there and I can help grow my channel, which is going to make it easier for me to do bigger and better things down the line. I do appreciate it and we will see you guys on the next video.